Good morning, everyone, and welcome to the Daily Devotional for this Friday. Um, I want to speak to you this morning just a little bit about the person of Jesus Christ and who he said he was compared to how people view him. Uh, my favorite show to watch on TV is NCIS. I love the show. Um, I'm currently, I went all the way back to the beginning on Netflix and I'm watching it through again. And in season seven, there is a show about a young man who was in the military and he decided to convert to Islam and become a Muslim. And his father was a Christian uh, preacher. And the writers of NCIS did everything they could do to paint the person from Islam and the religion of Islam in a positive light and to paint Christianity in a negative light. But that's neither here nor there. That's a, an opinion of the writers. But there was one line in the show that really just stuck with me and something I wanted to talk about this morning. The, the Christian father said, if I'm responsible for my son's death, then may God forgive me and his God too. And Mark Harmon, the uh, lead uh, character on NCIS said, they're one and the same. And that is a hugely dangerous message and could not be further from the truth. Here's the truth this morning. Now don't get me wrong, regardless of who you choose to believe, if you believe Islam is, is, is the, the correct religion, or you believe Buddhism is the correct religion, or you believe Christianity is the correct religion, although I believe Christianity is absolutely the correct religion, that's not the point I'm trying to make this morning. The point I'm trying to make this morning is all of those religions do not serve the same God. These are the words of Jesus Christ in John chapter 14 and verse 6. Jesus answered, I am the way, the truth, and the life. And no one comes to the Father except through me. Now what Jesus is saying in this verse is this. I'm the only path. If you want God, if you want eternal life, it only comes through Jesus Christ. There is no other world religion that teaches that. So they all can't be serving the same... Well, they're just all... They're all different paths to the same God, some people will say. And again, I say this. Jesus said, no one comes to the Father except through me. Jesus is saying, while you believe there are many paths to God, I'm telling you there's only one path to God. Whether you believe that or not is your choice because God gave us free will. But the bottom line is you cannot, and an argument cannot be made that all paths lead to God. So at least investigate, at least study and look into. If this Jesus claimed who he said he was, the way, the truth, and the life, and the only path to the Father then it's at least worth looking into. And if Jesus Christ rose from the dead, as the Bible says he did, then that would validate his claims that he's the only path to the Father. Something to think about this Friday. All religions do not serve the same God. And I wanted to make that point clear this morning. Have a wonderful weekend, friends. We'll see you Sunday.